I'm not gonna lie to you, man. If you men had told me two months ago Australian drillers exist, I would have just looked at you like Australian drillers. Stop the cap. <laughs> So, hey, I didn't even know you man had crime down there. I thought you was all petting kangaroos. You know what I'm saying? Saying I'm white, I'm white to, to everyone. You know what I'm saying? But you man been in my DMs. You man been telling me a lot of info, sending me bare videos, showing bare love. Two of you man said I should react to this video right here. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna do it. We're gonna see what it's saying. See about these Australian drillers. You know what I'm saying? So no stalling. Let's get straight into the video, man. <laughs> If you're from Western Sydney, you know that this was a war zone. Now he is war if you're from Western Sydney and you're watching this video, let me know. Is it a war zone down there? Let me know. War zone. Retaliation is a must. I know my beef is so. One four, Australia's first drill group of drama often associated with Chicago, the UK. True. But you know the only you see I'm saying I have a problem with with this, you know what I'm saying? You know when people say UK drill, but obviously there they have Chicago, they don't say American drill, they say Chicago drill. Really and truly, it's not UK drill. Like, it, Wales, Scotland, and um, Ireland had nothing to do with, you know what I'm saying, Mo most of your favorite artists. It's literally basically all from London. So it should really be Chicago and London drill, you know what I'm saying? But hey. I'm interested to hear what Australian drill sounds like. Guys. It's getting viral on Twitter, right? That was he. This is fire. Who has the biggest buzz around them right now? Crazy. Undeniably one four. <laughs> For me, drill music is storytelling. Yeah, storytelling cool. about um, your upbringing and what you've gone through and what you've witnessed, you know? If you know who's in Sydney, everyone in Sydney can tell you that no dude's got a name for violence. <laughs> it was a lot more worse than it is now. It's still. deserves to get beaten up then he was wearing a thong I don't... it was a lot more worse no than it is now it's... i have no remorse for that man still violence here and there you know bros stabbings other stuff we don't want to get into we could like explain our stories through music Bobby. we could actually paint that picture we could relate we can't relate to shooting or something we can relate to stabbing yeah. and punch ons though hey you hey you might tell me the truth well, what's the gun saying down there in australia I'm, i probably feel like yp wouldn't you know what I'm saying? We don't disclose, um, yeah, we, we, we can relate to guns on, on video. So you might let me know about that. I love just fucking twisting. We're going to be shooting a clip tonight. And everyone's going to be there. We're going to have bikes and that. Show you the hood out here. Okay. Everyone's going to come out tonight. Watch out, watch out, watch out. You are growing up here, you gotta have a dirt bike, you know? Just in case they wanna have fun and get away from the pigs and that. We'll have a couple bikes running the shoot as well, you'll see tonight. <laughs> we're, we're Australia's first and only drill group. <laughs> yeah. What makes us a drill group is that we actually do what we rap about. And true, it's home, you know? Yeah, it's a big place. It's the trenches. This is the area that needs the most support, you know? Yeah. It's, it's different to out near the beaches, you know? No one from the beaches comes around here. When I'm out and about and I'm out of the area, I do get homesick. We dress different out here, we talk different. Usually people like to wear shocks, TNs, maxis. Mm, I ain't gonna lie, the drip ain't here, I ain't gonna lie. Shocks, TNs, and maxis. I don't know. Truckies, you know? I mess with certain people in the Australian rap scene, but you know, they just hear stories and rap it. When other people, they're doing it, and then they rap it. At the end of the day, we're not, you know, rappers being gangsters. We've, we've done it, and now we're rapping. Yeah. You know? 
But not rappers were gangs. Hey, hey. That's a good look for you, Bobby. I ain't gonna lie. I like that for you. I like that. Telling a story. Show, show, show something for the camera also. Say something for the camera. Tell him what, what, tell him what, to what, tell him what used to happen in here, in this garage here. Oh, man, this is where it all started, you know, this is this is where we all grew up. This is where, before, where we fought, you know, all the best rappers. But, <laughs> <laughs> but, hey, Sully, what's up? Tell him where you're at right now. Fuck, you know, I'm dealing with my four walls, but that's alright, you know. I'm home. 100, bro, I'm soon home, he's in the four walls, you know. Hundred, soon on road. Set up one four from the west in Sydney. Running with boys where he tests is risky. G dub and the rest be fishy. Contagious men, I left them itchy. Well, we've learned through music and business and that, like touring is what you want to be and what you want to do. But what's been holding us back is like the boys' legals. You know, the boys are going. We got we got some boys that that do rap and are at court at the moment. Wow, my boys got pinched, like my friend Cell. You know, he could have been out here rapping still, but you know, he just couldn't leave the streets and that. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, Cellie's top. Top three best Australian draw rappers I've heard. I ain't gonna lie. Argue with yourself. Uh, the Sally is cold. Free Sally, man. Yeah, it's also. All the boys, you know, all the boys in the system doing it hard. But don't worry, you know, we'll be home soon. 100, bro. Yeah. Fuck lad, you should have seen how he's bleeding now. Covered in red, but I shipped him again because his man backed off when he needed help. Dripping blood from his body like he was donated to Red Cross. Pull out my shank and then jet off. Pull out my shank and then jet off. Sally's too cold. One of the boys, Selly, real close to a lot of these boys, man. This is Selly's, what was Selly's one? One of Selly's favourite houses to fucking bend her at. I mean, all the boys we used to drink in here, we used to have fires and that, you know. I don't know what's going on now, no one's here anymore, but yeah. I remember I came here one night, I was with Paulie, and um, I was sitting at this house. And was Paulie a girl or a guy, or LGTTT? Remember I came here one night, I was with Paulie. Is, is Paulie a girl or a guy or LGT? Let me know, let me know. And um, I was sitting at this house. And does she rap or he rap? I, I, I... And fucking Lebby came out of nowhere and I was like, what are you doing? Chopper everywhere. <laughs> and he was like, oh, and he pulled it there. I was like, cuz I'm fucking hiding this. And I was like, what? You're a mad cunt. You fool got pinched for that night too. Little boy too. Little white boy. He's like, he's up to his. Shorter. shorter, yeah. That's crazy. When you don't know how to fuck. That's wild, I ain't gonna lie. You gotta, you know, you gotta use what's around you. <laughs> I put that away, man. Yeah. Oh, we've got an ad. Today I'm taking two of my fa- I'm not gonna lie, I'm, oh yeah. I ain't got YouTube Premium, we're watching the ad together. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, we've got to watch the ad together. It's nearly done. I, I muted it for you, I've done my best. You feel me? I'm not editing it as, out as well. Okay, we're back now. I'm telling you, that was our best friend for every a good night, fucking man. year and a half. Every man. night, right? <laughs> Get a bird out every night. Every day, very special spot. First time I ever got jumped by police. <laughs> Shanks and shoes. I swear that's all we need when we go to the take that trip. Ay, ay. They used to throw their weight around, jump on us in the dark. There's no cameras out here, you know? And then when they used to find out our age and that, all of a sudden you're free to go, you know? No charges laid on nothing, you know? And we used to be cheering, you know? Oh yeah, we, we got away with it, but really, and they're just cleaning up their tracks hey, I, and then. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, hey, Jeff is kinda, he's kinda built, still is kinda stocky, I ain't gonna lie. Go home and that, you know? You wear a couple of niggas out, not me though. Man, that's so weird, man. That's so weird, man. At the end of the day, they're trying to do their job, but they've done more than that. I remember Al, one of JM's brothers, and um, they pinched him and they gave him a big beard and his face was not, not normal, you know? And just chucked him out the truck. They're, they're, they're at my front door every day. I'm not even on bail, not, not on nothing anymore, but they still show up, being menaces and that. So, got no love for them. Leave Bobby alone, man. If this video gets anywhere, tell, tell whoever's up there to fix the reception out here. We've got no reception on our phones and that. You can never get through to anyone, I swear. Yeah, that's why a lot of people don't call police out here. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Was that his voice? See how like every house that we walk past has got dogs in that? Because the crime rate was used to be so hard back in the day. All of these boys breaking enters and all that. So nearly every second house has a dog to warn the owners and that. 
there's a lot of stray dogs around here, you know? We used to get chased, bro, and a lot of the, a lot, a lot of our boys, we got a lot of chubby boys, you know, that can't get away in that, you know? So when we used to hit the fences and that, and they couldn't hit the fences properly, we had to jump down and that, and like, you know, just cause distractions and that, you know? This is where everything started, you know? All the boys used to link up back in the days, like three, four, maybe five years ago. Yeah, We're yeah. all real young, you know, still in school and that. We used to kick back in this garage here. We used to label them one four parties. Everyone from the area would come and they'd go off, you know. Yeah. Everyone used to turn on the coppers after the parties were getting shut down and that. Everyone would just wait for the end and just try to turn on the cops when they used to pull through, you know. Yeah. Can you imagine germs getting lit? I can't imagine it, you know, like, weird for angle. Bottles, rocks, everything. People end up on top of the houses and that. I think people used to come to the parties just to watch the fights afterwards as well. Yeah, people used to punch on, you know. Back in the days, you'd, you'd get your name out for being like a mad fighter or, you know, doing the craziest stuff. Mm. So, you know, if, if this kid, you know, if we heard that this kid, you know, ran up into a school and just, you know, played it again, you know, he'd get a big name out in the street saying, you know, wow, that guy did this. And someone would try and do a crazier thing, you know. Yeah, yeah, mama, one for veteran. Boss on my hood, cause I back my section. When I met the streets and slapped that thing, lad, I knew I felt my obsession. Mm -hmm. Had me running the ball, no question. Swear any op I saw, I pressed him. Boy. Was... <laughs> nah. uh, but yeah, ops are opposition. We, we, we adopted, we adopted that, that one from UK and US. They said op first. But around here, a real filthy word to call your enemies like dogs and gronks, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's Aussie slang, you know? Like, yeah, dog, you know? It's a rude word, rude word. Real disrespectful word, you know what I mean? When you get caught that, they're just labelling you with like, at the lowest, you know what I mean? Here in Australia. So what happens if you get caught that? Ha, <laughs> <laughs> fuck, it's all up to you. That's your pride you want to take care of. Down when I grip that steel, hands up when I bring that hammer. Oh, no. Come through while I pull that ching, have your head face down like a southwest ganger. Oh, On four, we ain't got God. no manners, only if you test my crew. If you ain't a part of this beef and you want to talk shit, you can get some. Yeah, no, the, the message is definitely that song. I ain't gonna lie, that, eh. Hey. Well, he's got a... I think that's the first track I rated from 1-4. I'm pretty sure I'm not... I, I forgot, I ain't gonna lie. Drink, leave me a drink, bro. Let's have a drink, pal. Might as well pop one open, eh? Hey. This is Australia's finest. <laughs> Woodstock, bro. Yeah, this is our this is our Jack Daniels and our Jim Beam. <laughs> hey, breakfast for Panadol, though. So tonight we'll be heading over to Emo. We're gonna shoot for our new single called Spot the Difference. Uh, you just see uh, you just see more boys, you know? You see more gang in that. So it'll be a good shoot too, because it's good energy and good vibes when it comes to this shoot, you know? Now it's good just to see everyone together, you know, everyone gets to turn in front of the camera. It's good to see everyone just have fun in that, you know? My district has too much if, hey, if you if you see my reaction to spot the difference, you know how I feel about it already. <laughs> Hey, how many um how many people in uh in one four? That's what I was gonna ask. It looks like they got a lot of members. I'll be real, a hell of a lot of members, but. One four was too active, was too urgent. If I ain't there in the field, cause then I guarantee you I'm working. My crew still in the trap, flipping packs, this and that. Can't lie, it looks lit. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> This is 27 District, but every national you name it, everyone's here, you know what I mean? I hear you, my brother's from 60 and that. Huh? 60, bro. 60, bro. Murder squad. Yeah, baby. Murder squad. Murder squad. Oh, yeah, now we just do music videos, yeah. So, because we can't tour in that, but. Yeah, music videos help uh, our views as well, you know. In Australia, not not many people do what we're doing, so it's it's good to see Australia do things like this. It's it's out of the ordinary for some people. Like who's that up on the floor? Oh, he's on a fucking belly. Like come to the front, come to the front, come to the front. Like who wants what we 
You see these realists? They talk that talk from gas for them boys. I ain't gonna dig it. Must be CG. Run through houses, kick down doors like rap the squad. They just talk fast, they drink cameras on, that's where they stick this from. They don't feel like they feel like they're pussies. But I just don't mind everyone and push it, push it, push it, push it. We violent men, they talk too much and silence them. I can't lie, the me the the vibes are looking immaculate right now. It looks so lit. I ain't gonna lie. And then plus this blade will take his life and more. Cause hello members, everyone's out on the block, whatever, wherever they're at or wherever, just lit. I fuck with it still. I ain't gonna lie. They say this shit disgusting, but I said we fucking love it. I fuck with Russian time and place in Oscar. Hey, 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 h